Hey, what's up everyone? Before we start the video, I just want to say I'm going to be doing a giveaway for my YouTube channel. So I'm going to be giving away the Amazon Alexa Echo Pop 2023. It is brand new. I did a video of the unboxing already and a little review of it. So I'm only doing this to subscribers. If you're not subscribed, then I'm sorry you don't have a chance to winning it. Um, but if you are subscribed and you want to get a chance to win this, in this video, in the comments, you have to write something about why you want the Amazon Alexa Echo Pop. I don't care what you say, but you just have to leave a comment and at least some way of contacting you, um, either an email or a Twitter handle or a Facebook handle or something. Uh, I will be picking the winner on Friday and I will be announcing it that same day on Friday. So again, if you want to have a chance at winning the Amazon Alexa Echo Pop, subscribe and comment why you want the Amazon Alexa Echo Pop. Alrighty, so let's get back in that video. Hey, what's up everyone? Today uh, I'm going to be checking out this Oster, Oster Digital French Door Oven with Convection. Now I got this for a birthday gift, so uh, I'm uh, happy to be unboxing this. It's going to be replacing this one in the background, as you see. So, uh, yeah, let's go ahead and get into it. Uh, but first, let me tell you about this real fast. It is a Oster Convection Oven 8-in-1 Countertop Toaster. It's an extra large. It fits two 16-inch pizzas, and it has two French doors, which makes it look very nice. So, uh, I was given this for a birthday gift, and I hadn't had the chance to open it and use it so today we're going to do that right now so let's do it let me see i'm going to be using this boy right here sharp as heck all right let's get into it Doesn't look like the box is damaged. So. This knife is so freaking sharp. You cut it like nine, you put pressure on it, and you cut the plastic off. So again, I was giving this as a birthday gift, and uh, hold on, take off my information. And I haven't been able to unbox it and try it out, so we're gonna do that today. I wanna unbox it, see what it comes with, see how it looks, and then I wanna do a test video of uh, of me putting a pizza in it to see if it cooks it pretty fast, if it cooks it pretty good or well. I'm gonna go ahead and pause the video, take it out. All right, so we got it out of the box and pretty much that's how it comes in the box. It comes with your, your user manual right here. And it comes with, I believe these are racks. Yeah, these are racks. It comes with two racks, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, let's see, I think, it is two, I think it's two racks. Yeah, it's two racks. Put that aside with the user manual. And then we're gonna get back into this right here. Take that styrofoam. I do like the way it looks, it looks very nice. Go ahead and rip this plastic off. Unless it has a slip already. Oh yeah, it does. Let 
And as you can see, this is how it looks. It looks very nice. See, it's a very nice oven. Uh, it does have a little bit of tape right here, and take it off. Also, tape on the bottom. So this is, it toasts your bread, it bakes, it broils as a turbo convection, a pizza setting, a warm setting, a defrost setting, and dehydrate setting. Uh, one thing I do want to test out is the dehydrate setting because I would love to put a couple of tomatoes in there or some bananas in there and dehydrate them. Let's open it up. Look at that. You only have to open one door to open the other one. Look at that. It's very nice. And then in here, I take it you got more racks, if I'm not mistaken. Let's see. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Okay, this is a tray. I don't know if this is a tray for the grease trap. Could be wrong. All right, could be right. And that's how it looks on the inside right there. Let me get a close. See? All right, so now that we unboxed it, uh, let me see what's this. Oh, okay, this is the for the bottom right here. I think this is the grease trap right here. that aside close the door back I'm very curious on how it's gonna cook uh, a pizza I want to see because this is the pizza that I want to test out first off let's put a rack in there and let's see if the pizza fits it because the pizza that I have is a 16 inch pizza and uh, this fits up to a 16 inch pizza so the other one that I have in the background that you see right there, that one doesn't fit nowhere near a 16 inch pizza. So you put this in here, you can slide it right there, it has little slots. Nice. Now let me get the pizza real fast. So even, even though it might not look like it, but this is a 16 inch pizza and it fits perfectly. Look at that. Oh, I guess it ain't a 16 inch. It's probably about, I'm going to say 14 inches in because it still has plenty of room. So you can fit probably a, well, a 16 inch pizza as it says. Wait a minute. Hold on. One second. I think I have it the wrong way. There we go. So I thought this side went this way in like that, but you got to put this side in first. It has little curb edges. So as you can see, it does fit a pretty large pizza. We're going to go ahead and uh, test it out. So I'm going to pause the video and then I'm going to go ahead and uh, start it up when I have it connected and over there. All right, we're back, and uh, I decided to leave the toaster oven right here for now. I'll move it later. I just want to test this out. I'm opening the pizza right now. I'm going to go ahead and put it in. I already um, turned it on, so it's ready to go. Actually, I should preheat it. Let's see. It does have a preheat button. Bake for... Four hundred and start. As you can see, it does say preheating. It would, it'll beep when it tells you uh, the oven is ready. And I do have the pizza right there, so uh, I'll resume the video when it's ready. All right, so the oven just beeped. It did beep like three or four times. So 
I'm going to go ahead and put this in there. Open it up. Place it right in the center. Close it. And we could put a timer for... Let's see. Timer will be for... 14 minutes so I'm gonna go ahead and stop the video do a hyperlapse video of it and then continue the video All right, so I did cook a pizza. Uh, I should have used the pizza mode, but I used the bake mode. Next time I will use the pizza mode. And uh, it cooked it perfectly. Look at that. I'm gonna show y'all right now. It's crispy. I know this is gonna be freaking hot. Yeah, it's hot. I think I may have put a little bit too much uh, time on it. But as you can see, look, that is a crispy pizza. Now I want to cut it real fast, so I'm going to put it right here. Go ahead and move the pizza right here. Close the door. Oopsie. So now I'm going to cut it so y'all can hear the crispiness. Hold on one second. All right, so it cooked it pretty good, so I'm going to go ahead and hear that crispiness. Put it to the side. Next, I'm going to be trying uh, bananas dehydrated, but as you can see, it cooked the pizza all the way through. It's very good. Um, put this aside. So again, I did uh, get this for a birthday gift. It's a Oster uh, convection oven, eight in one. I believe it's on Amazon for 270, 270. I'll put the link in the in the bottom. Um, this is the front, how it looks. Again, you have a couple of settings right here. You got toast, bake, broil, turbo convection, pizza, which I should have used, but I didn't. I used bake. You have warm, defrost, and dehydration. And then you got timer. You got temperature adjustment, clock, stop, cancel, and start. French doors, this is what the side looks like. Looks very clean. What the back looks like, very clean. And it did cook the pizza pretty good, as you can see. But again, I just wanted to check this out since it was a birthday gift and I haven't been able to check it out or unbox it and review it. Even though it wasn't meant for a review or unboxing, it was literally a birthday gift. But I decided, hey, why not review it? But again, I'm going to put the links in the description. Y'all can check it out if y'all want to. I just thought, hey, why not make a video of it? Until next time, I'll catch you on the next video. Bye-bye and take care.